Hello friends, welcome back to Infigyan. Today in this video, we are going to take up another very very interesting irrational equation with a square root. We are going to calculate x real. So let's get started by writing denominator 12 minus x cannot be 0. So our answer cannot be equal to 12. Now I will subtract x from both the sides. So minus x minus x from LHS minus and plus x will be over. Now x cannot be equal to 12. So I can multiply our equation which is square root 24 minus x over 12 minus x equal to 18 minus x by 12 minus x. Now I will write here multiplication with 12 minus x both sides. So that our denominator will get over 12 minus x will be cancelled out from LHS. So we can write a square root 24 minus x equal to 18 minus x times 12 minus x. Now I will take minus 1 common from this bracket, minus 1 common from this bracket. So we will be writing a square root 24 minus x equal to x minus 18 times x minus 12 minus 1 times minus 1 equal to plus 1. Now I can split 18 and 12 or minus 18 and minus 12. So I can write square root 24 minus x equal to x minus 15 minus 3 minus 15 minus 3 is minus 18. Now x minus 12, we will write x minus 12 will be minus 15 plus 3. So here we are having x minus 15, x minus 15. Let's try to create x minus 15 in LHS also. So we will write a square root 24 minus x equal to x minus 15 minus 3 x minus 15 plus 3. Now we can write 24 minus x. How it will be? We will write 9 minus x minus 15 in the bracket. 9 minus x plus 15. So 9 plus 15 is 24. We will write our RHS once again x minus 15. Let us write plus 3 here x minus 15 minus 3. Now we are going to consider our substitution. Let us say x minus 15 equal to u. So we can write our equation in u square root 9 minus u equal to u plus 3 times u minus 3. Now we know that the difference of two squares formula or identity which is a plus b times a minus b. We can write a square minus b square. So our LHS will be square root 9 minus u RHS would be u square minus 3 square will be equal to u square minus 9. So our final equation is square root 9 minus u equal to u square minus 9. Let me write here square root 9 minus u equal to u square minus 9. Now I will write domain of the equation if we can write quickly. So this radicant must be positive. RHS must be positive. So for left hand side we can write u value u should be less than 9. Once 9 minus u is positive u must be less than 9. From RHS we will write two conditions. u should be less than minus 3. u should be greater than 3. 
now we have to take intersection of these two conditions so we'll be getting two intervals i will write both u less than minus 3 and u should be in the interval 3 and 9 so we have to make sure or we have to check our solutions it should be either in the interval 3 to 9 or it should be less than minus 3 once our answer is in u now i will consider squaring here so i will write square root 9 minus u whole square equal to u square minus 9 whole square now we will cancel square root with square from lhs so 9 minus u will be equal to u square minus 9 whole square now we will subtract u square from both the sides so i will write minus u square minus u square now we can apply difference of two squares formula once again in our right hand side and from left hand side we can take minus one common so i will write minus one in the bracket u square plus u minus nine this is our lhs and in rhs we will write a plus b times a minus b so u square plus u minus 9 in first bracket plus u minus 9 in first bracket u square minus u minus 9 in the second bracket now you can see u square plus u minus 9 u square plus u minus 9 we will take all the terms to rhs and then we will take u square plus u minus 9 common. Let me write here u square plus u minus 9 common. So in other bracket we are going to write u square minus u minus 9 plus 1 equal to 0. Or u square plus u minus 9 times u square minus u minus 8 equal to 0 using product 0 rule we can write either u square plus u minus 9 equal to 0 or u square minus u minus 8 equal to 0 so we are going to use quadratic formula to solve both the quadratic equations so if i will write formula u will be equal to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 a c over 2 times a so for quadratic u square plus u minus 9 if i will write a then it is 1 value of b coefficient of u value is 1 c constant minus 9 for our quadratic equation u square minus u minus 8 equal to 0, we will write a equal to 1, b equal to negative 1 and c equal to negative 8. Let us use quadratic formula to figure out values of u. So I will write u equal to minus b, so minus 1 in this case, plus minus square root of. 1 a square is 1 minus 4 times 1 times minus 9 plus 36 over 2 times 1 is 2. So we are going to get two real values from first quadratic equation minus 1 plus minus square root 37 over 2. Now we will consider second quadratic, we will apply quadratic formula u will be equal to minus b so minus of minus 1 is plus 1 plus minus square root of minus 1 square is 1 minus 4 times 1 times minus 8 so minus 4 times minus 8 plus 32 over 2 times 1 is 2 we will get two real values 1 plus minus 
square root of 33 over 2. So in total there are 4 real u values. Now we will apply our condition on u. Let me write all the 4 values of u first. So u will be equal to, I will split, I will consider plus and minus sign separately. So minus 1 plus square root 37 over 2 minus 1 minus a square root 37 over 2 then we will write 1 plus a square root 33 over 2 and last value will be 1 minus a square root 33 over 2 if i will write here the approximate values of our answers then i will write here 2.5 approximately approximate value second solution would be approximately minus 3.5 here i can write approximately 3.4 and here we can write approximately minus 2.4 now condition on u was let me write here u should be less than minus 3 or u should be in the interval 3 and 9. So on this ground we are going to reject two solutions. First one and the last one. So these two solutions we are going to accept. So if I will write here u equal to. So minus 1 minus a square root 37 over 2 first solution and second solution we are going to write 1 plus a square root 33 over 2 but this is value of u now we have to use our substitution u was x minus 15 so i will write here equal to x minus 15 now we will add 15 to both sides to get our final answers so x will be equal to 15 then we will write minus 1 minus root 37 over 2 i will write here plus sign let us put in the bracket then we will write 15 plus 1 plus root 33 over 2 now we have to take lcm only so 30 minus 1 we will write 29 minus root 37 over 2 our first real solution and 15 times 2 is 30 plus 1 31 plus a square root 33 over 2 so in total we have two real solutions i hope friends you will like this video thank you so very much for watching do not forget to like share and subscribe Bye-bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye-bye.